Stop whatever it is you're doing right now. Focus and block out whatever it is that has you distracted. Lock in and listen. I don't really care what you say. They are more concerned with what you do. We hear people say that actions speak louder than words, but those same people are saying it more than they are doing it. Ultimately, your daily actions determine what your goals are. It's up to you to make sure your actions and goals know what their roles are. Meaning, you must self-assess and know what the holes are and execute towards your true passion and soon you'll get that gold star. See, stars like you know that on the road to glory, there will be moments that will define your story. Think about what I'm saying. Words are the talk. Actions are the walk. Don't tell me you're going to do something. I'd rather you show me. Don't talk about it. I'd rather you be about it. And all of a sudden, you want to quit. All of a sudden, you want to drop out. All of a sudden, you want to give up. Lock in and listen harder than you've ever listened before. Because quitting is not an option. Dropping out is not an option. Giving up is not an option. The only option is for you to start living up to your potential. What I need you to understand is, words are the talk. Actions are the walk. Because at this very moment in time, you are ready to break. You're ready to break like a glass jar. You are ready to break like a speeding car. Breaking is not who you are. See, right now, my friend, it's simple. You are in the dark. And you know what I need you to do for me when you're in the dark, right? Turn the lights on when I'm talking to you because you said your goal was to graduate. You said your goal was to make yourself, your parents, and your family proud. Those are your words, not mine. Because at the end of the day, your words don't mean much. It's your action. Okay, I get it. You know, right now you feel like the world's biggest loser. But this is the moment that I need you to transform and become the world's biggest chooser. Because I need you to choose to start digging. I need you to choose to start climbing. I need you to choose to start redefining. I need you to choose to start realigning and priming yourself for a major comeback. Be different. Think different. Words are the talk. Actions are the walk. Now, all you got to do is walk the talk. Your actions are what people will remember you by, not your words. Now, they might remember you said a cool quote or how much you sounded like some intellectual philosopher. But if you don't practice what you preach, how much do people really believe you? So let's do the math. The common denominator is you. And you have fallen into that woe is me syndrome. But I need you to detox and get that wine out of your system and change that woe is me syndrome into the oh it's me syndrome. Because yes, my friend, you are the problem. And so I need you to own and not rent that fact. Your actions are what makes your words believable. It's not the words that make the actions believable. Don't get them mixed up. If you want someone to believe you when you say something, then you have to do something. Words alone can't cut it. Never have, never will. Words are the talk. Actions are the walk. We all know someone that says, I'm going to be successful. I'm going to be famous. I'm going to be a millionaire. But every time you see them, 
They're just chilling, relaxing, hanging out, posted up, just being lazy. So what that tells me is that they have the words, but not the action. The fact of the matter is, if you're being totally transparent, it's apparent that you're not maximizing your time. You are not in recycle mode because you continue to waste countless hours on meaningless time-wasting activities. I need you to take an hour, at least an hour. Sit your butt down, reevaluate, and that means self-assess. Look in that mirror and confess that you are not giving 1,000%. You are not putting every ounce of your heart and soul into it. And thus, you need a remedy. Now let's fix this. Your teacher or professor assigns the work. Your teacher or professor schedules the test. It's up to you to manage your study time so you can put your best foot forward. So when you're playing video games, when you're shopping at the mall, when you're at the party and the DJ is rocking, when you're surfing the internet at your leisure, when you're out with your friends grabbing a pizza or doing a host of other things that don't involve studying or completing an assignment. That's what I mean when I say your actions and your goals are not in alignment. Because you wrote down graduate. And what's that? Facts. So now it's time for you to reenact this part of your movie. Talk is cheap. Your actions are expensive. You want people to value who you are? Then you have to be worth something. How do you become worth something? By doing what you say you're going to do. In other words, we're talking about action. Words don't do much. Actions do everything. Think about it. All of the famous people that have become success stories didn't get there by simply talking about being there. They did something about it. They worked their butts off to be where they are today. They got off the couch. They made something happen. They realized that words are weak. They realized that talk is cheap. They realized that if they didn't get up and do something about their situation, then they'd still be in that situation. Now it's time for you to reenact this part of your movie by going all in on all things related to passing every class this semester. So replace the wasted time with study and watch how quick you become an excellent tester. Your academic stock will soar like an eagle. This may require you for a short period of time to become a hangout with friends protester. Because you're so hungry to pass every class with flying colors. You understand you must eat and drink your subjects and become an official scholastic digest. Now this goes for every aspect of your life. Think about it. But it's the action. It's the act of showing up to pass the exam that counts. And never forget, your daily actions determine what your goals are. It's up to you to make sure your actions and goals know what their roles are. Meaning you must self-assess and know where the holes are. And execute toward your true passion and soon you'll graduate. And get that gold star, a.k.a. your diploma. So here's to you and the future success that awaits. And your testimony of going from almost flunking out to all smiles with your diploma when your class graduates. You got this, my friend. So keep pushing with purpose, focus, and determination. And never lose sight that you hold the key to your success. It just requires preparation, dedication, calculation, and internal motivation. Now throw your cap in the air and celebrate.